While Alicia and Borgie are off exploring, Jamie and I have set up camp here and I'm just about to cook some dinner. Tonight, we are having a camp oven casserole with an Italian twist. First of all, we're gonna start off some beautiful chopped up flank steak from our cow. And this is from a little farm in Dorigo. Steve and Michelle have been our cow farmers for a fair while now. They have an unbelievable operation. It's all grass fed. We run a um, cow calf operation here, all short horns. Meat quality is what we're after. And giving people prime products, you know, the best of the best. You, you don't have to go to a restaurant. You can actually stay at home and feed your kids ethically grown beef. We want someone who has a steak to go, damn, that was a good steak. And where did that steak come from? Thanks, Thanks for supporting our farm. farm. Making a big old casserole tonight. We have camera crew, we have Jamie, so there's going to be a lot of food. Adding in some dry stock, some onion and garlic. I totally quadrupled the garlic in here because I just love garlic. And some thyme. All right, now we obviously need a little bit of liquid in there to get everything cooking nicely. So here's some liquid stock and I need some wine. Jamie, you hear that? Always happy. <laughs> Bit of red wine, wouldn't be Italian cooking if it didn't have wine. And adding in a few tins of tomato. Put in one more tin, we've got a few people to feed. All right, mix all of that up. Yum oh. All right, let's go chuck this on the fire. Well, it's been a little over an hour. It's time to add the twist I was telling you about. Oh, that looks awesome. In this bowl, I've mixed up some ravioli, some bacon mince, some cheese, and a bit of pasta sauce. Now this is gonna go on top of this mixture here. And it's gonna get nice and crispy once we put it back over the fire. Yes. All right, just gonna add a little bit more cheese on top. And a few breadcrumbs. So we're gonna put a fair bit of heat back on the top of this. Hopefully within about 15 minutes, everything will be nicely cooked up and golden and it'll be ready to eat. Oh, that looks fantastic. Cooked to perfection. That meat is gonna be so tender. All right, well, that's me done for the night. I'm gonna go eat this. How about we see what Leash and Borgie are up to?